Ahoy, fellas! Today we're in this area, and I'm going to be exploring it for as long as it takes to find um, anything, really. I guess I kind of already did that a little bit, but uh, I'm going to be kind of dual looking for wiggerlings while also trying to find this patch I'm looking for, you know? If I can almost. That would have been interesting, huh? I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. There we go. Really want to find the freaking spore patch so that I can freaking plant mushrooms. It's all I want. Alongside a bunch of wicked links, of course. But, you know, those are kind of secondary, aren't they? Did I really miss this? Honestly, a couple of these are really just hidden in sight, and... Okay, that explains it. There's probably one... What the heck? Huh? How does that make sense? Do I have to, like... Get over here or something? <laughs> I'm kind of confused by this. I'm assuming... I have to... Uh, take this up here, or not. How the heck do I get that? Yeah, no clue. Alright, cool. I'm assuming it has something to do with the, um, the slug sitting on the, uh, destructible thing there. But I have no clue, because, I mean, that's not my job. Uh, I guess it kind of is my job, but, you know. So my job. Okay, never mind. That only goes one direction. They all only go one. Well, they go both directions, sort of. Sort of. You know, I have been having fun lately. Sort of. It's it's been a little whack. I'm not gonna lie. Because. I, it's just not much has been going on, but it's been full enough that I don't... Uh, I don't know. I guess it's nothing new is what it is. I was sitting in my computational thinking class. It's basically a coding class. It's a data analytics with Python class, right? And it's like uh, day three, week two, all that jazz. And he's still talking about, like, basic algebraic stuff. Oh, okay, there we go. Cool. That was all I had to do. Uh, it's another Wakerling episode. Um, but, jeez. I, I don't know what to say to my freaking professor, honestly. It's just, um, I'm really heavily considering just not attending class, even though it's one of the ones that I haven't done before. I don't know Python, you know. I know a little bit of HTML, if that would even help me, but I have my doubts just a little bit about whether or not that would actually help me all that much. So, instead, I probably should attend class. Yeah. Um. But boy, is it going to be boring as all heck. I don't know, there's not really any way to get around that, it doesn't seem. Either, so... Uh, I'm just kind of stuck where I am with, in, with that. A little bit. Where do I want to go? Definitely not down here, I've already kind of talked. Done all this crap already, sheesh. There aren't even wet, well there's one. Not worth going through there yet, though. Not yet, at least. Actually, how much... How many do I have? I have ten. Huh. Well, um... I could decide to kind of detour around and pick up uh, the spare wickerlings. Um, for the sake of completion. I really want to know what's in this area. Because there's like a tunnel there and everything, and there's this kind of cloudy area. I just, uh, I get the 
feeling it's not what I think it is, and it's also going to be very difficult to actually get to just possibly. Well, maybe not. Maybe, maybe not. <sighs> Let's just go back up. I was hoping it was going to be in this area, and it wasn't. Yeah. Oh well. I've been having a fun- actually, you know, I talked about a boring class, and I may as well talk about a fun class. I was in statics, and my statics professor is very interesting. <laughs> he's, he's the kind of professor where it's a very enjoyable class, but you're kind of surprised that he isn't, like, written up or something, you know? <laughs> it's enjoyable for all the reasons you would think he would like, immediately lose his job. <laughs> it's all memorable and all that, and I can appreciate it and all that, but he's got a freaking wicked sense of humor, and it's just... It, 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 the class isn't, like, stand-up for 50 minutes, but... <laughs> it's... Uh, darn near, about as close as you can maybe get and still effectively teach a class, yeah. It's impressive, honestly. Now, let's see... Okay. I did it on purpose, alright. Never mind, I didn't do it on purpose. Please. Okay, fine. I'll go the long way. Okay... 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 Now I'll go the long way. Wouldn't it be fun if I didn't suck at this game? Then I would not suck at this game, yeah? Not my intention, I wanted to catch the ball. Not just throw it away. This seems to be a much better option for me. And there we go, of course not. There we go. Alright. Now if I can just... We are perfect. It's the most I have ever asked for. That's like three entire wickerlings in quick succession, which I would normally say is justification for the entire episode, but I've been doing only wickerling catching episodes for the past, uh, what, three episodes? So, you know, maybe I should actually find something else. I just, I honestly don't know where to start with some of these places. I guess this big cave would be a start, yeah. but I remember very blatantly there not being much abounding. Yeah, you know, it's getting trickier, it is getting trickier. Apparently, this is what 90% completion looks like, so yeah, we still have the same size map and just less ideas about where new things could be. By we, I mean I, because you know, you're not playing the game, are you? I suppose you might be. You might be playing the game along with me. Ain't that nice? Jeez. Okay, I think, I think, I think. I might be able to get down into that cavern through here. Probably. Possibly. This is what it sounds like when I don't know what I'm talking about. Oh, you know what? I don't know what's up there. Okay, that works, I guess. We made it back to the Church of the Space Monks. We have not been here a very long time. What I want to know is if there's any way to get up the rightmost wall. I get the feeling there is not. But, you know. Oh, jeez. Disguised amongst you. Thanks. I know. 
You really helped me out there, Myrtle. You were real, real quick on the uptake. Wow. What a guy. Anyways, that would have been an interesting little piece of lore to figure out much, much earlier, huh? Um. <laughs> you know what would be actually really cool to figure out? Just yesterday, I was filming Deponia. And I was getting wacky audio feedback. Like, sounded like I bass boosted the audio for no reason. I'm not entirely sure why. I, uh. I didn't really do anything to remedy it either, because I'm not sure why it happened. I guess I kind of did. I changed how the noise suppression worked, sort of, but. I'm still not entirely sure we actually did the right thing. Ah, oh, come on. Ah, oh, come on. Here I go. Here I go killing again. Go through here, I guess. You know, warm dry and quiet sounds a lot like the space monk sanctuary to me maybe it's up here I guess they didn't specifically say warm but you know see look right there now how would I get to that um how the heck do I get I knew it I have to to get like a perfect swing on the freaking. Uh, we're actually doing it this time, guys. We actually found the spore points. We're doing it. Yeah. I just have to do that thing that I'm so good at. Oh, wow. Okay. We did it, guys. We did that thing that I'm so good at. I sworn there was a wickerling there, but there's not. We did it. We planted the spores. Heck yeah. Got something nice for you. Thanks! And it's gonna be something nice for the viewers of the next episode. That's right. We're gonna talk to the fungoid on the next episode of Yoku's Island Express. Yes, I do have to talk like that every time I end an episode. It's an unspoken rule. I speak it just about every time. Uh, uh, at least I didn't land in water. This is fine. Till then, like, comment, and subscribe, or I will waterboard you. Oh, that is a much more forgiving exit than I thought it was going to be, I'm not going to lie. Yep, I'll waterboard you. Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.